Right, hello guys, and welcome back to the part three of the Learn English with Jose, and I'm here. We have just finished the uses. Uh, we we have just finished and find out what are the uses of the present simple and the present continuous, and now we'll find out what are the dynamic and the state verbs. Okay, so look on the screen, or if you don't have a book, look on the screen, or you can look at your book. For more information, dynamic and state verbs. Dynamic verbs describe actions and can be used in the simple or continuous form. Dynamic verbs. What are those? Example like chase, chase somebody, uh, walk, go, swim, uh, talk, uh, a lot, play, chat. Uh, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of verbs. Those are not dynamic verbs that can describe uh, the actions and can be used in the simple or continuous. Example: I walk the dog every day. I walk the dog every day. So that is the the uh, dynamic the dynamic verb walk. That means I can use it in the present simple and present continuous. Like I am walking the dog tomorrow. I am walking the dog tomorrow. So I can use walk in the present simple, and I can also use walk in the present continuous. So that is the dynamic verb a lot. But state verbs describe the states or situations, and those verbs are not usually used in the continuous tenses. Common state verbs include. Believe, belong, forget, hate, know, like, love, mean, need, prefer, remember, understand, want. Fourteen, fourteen verbs, fourteen state verbs. So you you can use four these fourteen these fourteen state verbs in the present simple only. You cannot use it in the present continuous, like. Uh, like the verb love. Okay, love. People always say I love you, but they cannot say, but they do not say I am loving you. Maybe you 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 hear them say that on maybe on some channel TV channel or some TV show, but that they are they are trying to make people fun that. For fun, for speaking, but not. But if you put that in the situation of writing in the text, they will minus your score of using that. Okay, so just like this. Um. Uh. Need, need. Okay, need. Uh, I need you right now. I need you right now. Okay, you cannot say I am needing you right now. Okay, I need you right now. I remember, I remember that this day, yesterday, this time, yesterday, I was at school. So you cannot say I am remembering. You cannot say like like that. So these are state verbs, only used in the present simple, but cannot be used in the present continuous, because why? They are state verbs. Why they are state verbs? Ask them. Don't ask me. <laughs> okay, so I have described what are the dynamic verbs and the state verbs are. So now we will put that in the exercise number five. We'll do it. Okay, so before we do the exercise number five, we'll have to find the two state verbs in the text. The two state verbs in the conversation. Okay. Okay, so the first one. Hi, hey Zoe. You are always using the computer when I need it. Now that need it is the state verb. Need and the next one. And I can also find the next state verb in a conversation is um love. Cool. I love the science fiction film. Right on the last. Last sentence before the previous sentence before the last sentence. Okay, I love science fiction film. 
You cannot say, I am loving science fiction film. No, no one says like that. Okay? I love. Love is a, a state verb. Okay? So the exercise number five, what do they tell us to do? Uh, complete the, 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 the dialogue with the present simple or present continuous. Listen by listening it to it. Okay, so are you ready? Take a pen and a book. Or if you don't have your book, look on, the, on your screen and take a notebook and write down the answers. If you cannot hear, pass. Okay? Try to hear as fast as possible. Okay? Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Who are you phoning? Joe, the film starts in five minutes. She never arrives on time. Hi, Joe. Are you coming to see the film? Okay. She's just getting off the bus. She'll be here in a minute. Great. What are you doing after the film? We're going for a pizza. Do you want to join us? Yes, I love pizza. But the last bus home leaves at 10.30. I mustn't miss it. Hi, Zoe. Hi, Ella. What are you doing here, Max? I'm going to see the film. I'm waiting for Sam. Shall we all sit together? No way. Hmm. So, um, Max and Zoe has a very, very, uh, good, good friendship. Uh, okay, so have you filled in all your blanks? Okay, so if yes or if not, let's correct with me, okay? So let's listen again and do it. Exercise 5. Who are you phoning? Who are you phoning? Okay, who are you phoning? So I will just write the answers, okay? The, 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 the phrases you need to fill in the blanks. Are you phoning? Okay, so number two. Joe, the film starts in five minutes. Start. She Start. never arrives on time. She never arrives with S, okay? Start. And never arrives. Number four. Time. Hi, Joe. Are you coming to see the film? Hey, Joe. Are you coming to see the film? Are you coming? Are you coming to see the film? Uh. Okay, she. Okay. She's just getting off the bus. She. Just getting, she is just getting off the bus. Okay, so we'll be right back with the mm, the last part of a learn English. We will say and we'll correct the 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 blank number six. Don't go anywhere.